So, the wife and I recently rented this U-Haul. This is a 15-foot box truck. This has the 6.8 liter V10. And uh, we were keeping up with traffic pretty well on the major interstates. We were doing, you know, 80 pretty much all the way. And uh, anyway, I'm impressed with it. It was clean, tires were in good shape. Everything was pretty, you know, usable. We didn't have to do anything. Just jump in and go. Switch, a U-Haul should work. But I wanted to show you guys this. Doesn't look like anyone's gonna be stealing a catalytic converter on this thing. They built a nice cage for it. <laughs> we actually got the U-Haul in New York, Staten Island. So uh, it must be a problem there in the cities. People stealing catalytic converters. All they needed is a, is a battery operated sawzall. But I thought that was pretty impressive. Looks like some half inch rebar. <laughs> How cool is that? I've seen something similar to that, but never on a commercial vehicle like that. So that's pretty cool. So here's the other side of that catalytic converter guard. I don't know if they do that to all of the U-Haul models or if it's just the ones that they, uh, they have expensive catalytic converters. And look at this, they even went as far to post a uh, tag on the catalytic converter. So if those show up at a local recycling yard, they're gonna know it. They'll probably get a phone call saying, yeah, we got one of your catalytic converters. I mean, that's half inch rebar. That's awesome. Someone was thinking with that, someone was being creative, but it must have been an issue or they wouldn't have went to the extent to weld these up and bolt them on. Very cool. I was actually really impressed with this U-Haul. I mean, this thing, this is a 15 foot model. They call it the easy mover or something like that. But uh, I was more impressed with the ruggedness of this, you know, the build of this bumper and everything too. This is, this is 3 16 galvanized. And check out this receiver hitch right here. You got a two inch receiver and look at the structure of this thing. I mean, you could haul a tag trailer with a piece of equipment on this thing. <laughs> if only they provided you with a uh, trailer brake controller. This has the V10, you know, this thing probably has some pretty good get up and go for, you know, a trailer, a good sized trailer. I was really impressed with that. And they give you the seven pin connector. I mean, what are they, what are they thinking people are going to be hauling with these things? <laughs> I'm just, I'm really impressed with this receiver hitch. I mean, that has some serious bracing. I know it's not a big deal, probably for most people, but I just get a kick out of that because that is extremely overbuilt for like the average car trailer. But I think it's cool, that's nice. They got this forward brace here, which is gonna add a lot of rigidity to the tongue. And they've got some pretty substantial gusseting and bracketry in there. And that bottom piece right there, that's about an inch thick plate. <laughs> that's cool. The other funny thing I saw was that they put the uh, basically the extended valve stem for the inner dual as if the regular homeowner is going to have you know capabilities to air the tires up to 80 pounds <laughs> but that's still cool there's a lot of nice features on this truck i'm going to keep my eyes open for the uh in the used market for one of these vans i mean this thing i'm really impressed with this thing this would make a really nice shed on wheels basically if i can get one for a decent price you now it's got a really nice box all kinds of room, nice flat floor. So anyway, overall I'd say the U-Haul experience is pretty good. And uh, this thing, if you get one of these U-Hauls, make sure you get the V10, because what a difference that thing makes. I was envisioning, you know, 50 miles an hour, 55 miles an hour all the way back and dreading it. But this thing, I'll tell you, doesn't get good fuel mileage. I think I was getting close to eight, maybe 10 miles to the gallon, but so anyway, I just figured I'd make a quick video. I was pretty impressed with this U-Haul. It's pretty cool.